My lady and I, we, I moved in with my lady and her best friend, Sarah. I moved in with two chicks. That's what my friends said. They went, nice. It's not, though. No. Because I'm only banging one of them. But I argue with both of them, all right? That's, that's the worst deal ever. Nobody signs up for that. Nobody's like, hey, can I get double the argument and half the vagina? That'd be amazing. We could get 12 months of that. Sometimes when I argue with the one that I'm not even banging, the one that I am banging won't bang me because I argued with the one that I wasn't banging, which makes me want to go bang, because that makes no sense. It's not how the world should work. It's awful. One thing I wasn't ready for was going apartment hunting with two women, not prepared. That's tough. I've gone apartment hunting with guys before, and that's easy. Guys are simple. We don't even all go look at the place, do we? No. We just send one guy. Usually the youngest, whoever has like a stupid nickname, we send his dumb ass. And he comes back, he does like a report and reports back to us. He goes, eh, this place kind of smelled like piss. <laughs> that doesn't even kill the deal, does it? No, we're like, all right, calm down. How much piss are we talking about? On a scale of one to homeless, what kind of, what's the deal? It's not that bad, let's be open-minded. Not with women, they hated every place. As soon as you step into a place, I, they would just go, <sighs> What does that mean? What does that mean? What does that mean there's asbestos? What does that mean? They used lead paint in the 60s? What happened here? Just awful, they hated every place. Then we found one I thought was perfect. Right around bedrooms in our price range. I'm like, we did it, we're done. Just as I get all excited, my, my lady's best friend Sarah goes, it was okay, but there wasn't as much natural light as I thought there would be. And I was like, excuse me? That's a factor on living somewhere? That's not a factor to any man I know. I could move into an apartment tonight with no windows and not even notice. I wouldn't even know until someone came over and said, hey, you don't have any windows. And I'd be like, what about that thing? And I'd be like, well, that's a door. I'm like, well, it's multi-purpose, all right? You want natural light, you open my wind door and you let that in. Easy, we're easy people. So I talked to this, you know what made me mad? The room that Sarah was gonna get, one of the four walls was a window. And what I mean by that, it didn't have like a tiny window. I mean, one of the walls was made of glass from ceiling to floor, wall to wall, nothing but glass, nothing but just natural light pouring in, bouncing off her stupid head. That's all that was happening in that room. And I said, what's your situation? What's your issue with this? And she goes, well, the way the window's positioned, the sun's only gonna come in like half the day. And I'm like, that's how the sun works. <laughs> That's how that thing in the sky works. You get it for half the day, then it goes over. Jerks in China get some sun. Everybody gets some sun. It's spread evenly like mayo on a sandwich. Everybody gets a little. It's brutal. It's my life. Like what you just saw? Subscribe below to our YouTube channel and you can see even more.